Hello, I'm Casper. Welcome to the park. Two feet. Twenty-eight today. And I'm trying to get these arrays to line up. Two times. Twice. I hate you both. <laughs> Terribly. Terribly two-sided Tony. Eight, six, seven, five, three, nine, nine. What, what is that? Tommy Two Tone? Tommy Two Tone, Jenny. Jenny, I got your number. Oh, I no, got um, it off the bathroom wall. <laughs> that is the best place to get them. At the yeah. adult film store. Okay. Nah, I need to. <laughs> yeah, it is! They're like, I was looking at our section. I'm like, we have our own section. <laughs> oh, Why don't you just die? <laughs> He's like, ah, look, this is how Gary acts. He runs around in circles and then he tries to bite you. <laughs> hey, he doesn't try and run in circles when I'm there. He just tries to bite me. They don't like weird people. Then he really shouldn't get along. <laughs> The magical array. Oh, uh, why am I going near this guy? So, if you're wondering what happened at the same Isaac time the, on the same Isaac channel, it's still her running away from the beast. Gary. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we've named it Gary. Hey, there's one of my hats. Is it one that the dog ate? No. Ha 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 ha! Give me now! Give me now, bitch! And then, like, one just appears behind her, like, hey. No, he's the only one that leaves right now. I swear to God, Dougal! <laughs> <laughs> we don't have Our the door pizza. shut because it's crazy hot. Then, like, I'm talking my arm is so dripping like a faucet. Dougal! No! Stop! Sa <laughs> I know that's sexy. You guys all want to hear about it, right? I'm sorry. Where's it at? There it is. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna kill you! Can you keep walking over that wire? Hang on, I'll be right back. You're walking over the wire too. Come oh, on, let me get it! Let me get it! Don't kill me! No, oh, that was not good. I need one more good one. Where's it at? Do you see it? No. <laughs> <laughs> Point to your screen and tell me where it is. Oh, there it is. There it is. <laughs> no, that's a bad one. Blast. I'm dead. <laughs> I know everybody missed that. Seeing her die, she's like died every episode right now. No, not every episode. Most she didn't die last one. That's like it. She's like, I'm gonna have to make a death counter, and she didn't expect what was gonna happen. Like, I'm literally, I, I just, uh, I've she's been at editing, like seventy. Okay. I've been editing. I edited episode fourteen today, and I'm up to seven. Well, at least it's not Dark Souls. I just, oh my god, it's so ridiculous. Dark Souls is horrible. Well, that's definitely me. It made me cry the first time I played it. Not really. Like, I Actually, literally... the first time I played it, I raged so hard because I fell off something one time that I quit. I just stopped altogether. You fell off something? Come on, guys. It's brutal. Come get me. Come get me. The second time I went back to it, it was a lot easier because I had the patience for it. But that final boss, everybody's like really good at parrying, besides me. My fucking lord. I cannot parry anything. So the final boss was just terrible. Except when I finally beat him, I didn't take any damage. Yeah, you go I finally learned how to parry that son of a bitch. And then you're like, this was easy! Ah. Uh -huh. And then I still need to uh, beat Dark Souls 2. 
I think I'm just gonna get it on the Xbox One and say F it. That way I can get all the uh, DLC too. I would pick that for Bandit to play on our That's New show, but uh, that'd take forever. Uh, Skyrim still can take forever. Well, if we played for like a day marathon, I think we'd have it done. What are you doing tomorrow? No, just kidding. We're doing a Batman marathon. Yeah, we're doing a live stream, man. Okay. It'll just be one single go until we're done. Which we need to figure out making it work tonight. I'm thinking about doing some YouTube shows of ranting. Rant, rant, rant. Can you I do. do this? No. Yeah, I like what Well, I'm going to rant about Halo 4. About Halo 4. Because everyone just stopped playing because they're like, it's a terrible game. But is it really that terrible? I think it suffers the Robocop effect. Which I know it's been done before, but I call it the Robocop effect. I like Robocop. Like the original was so good. But, but then they make, it. they make the remake, but they have to compare it constantly instead of seeing it as its own Which thing. I like the remake as its own thing anyway. I, I'm not a big fan of the remake, reboot, whatever you want to call it, but still yet, it it's not as bad as they make it seem, I don't think, at least. And then... Now, Halo 4 isn't a reboot, but people, hate it anyway. people keep comparing it to Bungie's because they're like, oh, well, they have to be exactly like Bungie to make it a good game. Whatever. No. Just stop trying to make it a Bungie game and see this company as their own thing because they're decent and they can make it... Like the, look at all of its... Um, not ancestors reviews. Look at all those reviews. They're all pretty high. They're not bad. And then, you know, they hate. They're like, well, the multiplayer is not right because you know, the BR takes five shots instead of four shots. Blah blah. blah. Holy shit! Are you kidding me? You're welcome, America. Then the BR. <laughs> World. They're like, oh, just give us a chance. Well, we're setting our multiplayer up so you'll enjoy it. But nobody came back. Out of like a million people that bought it, 2,000 of those people came back. Woo! Yeah, because I, I think it's a decent game. I mean, that's a lot of people not to come back. But you, you're going to tell me that these brainless morons that didn't come back, which I know some people did come back afterwards too, but the ones that didn't come back because... The multiplayer's broken. You idiots went back to Battlefield 4. You idiots went back to Grand Theft Auto Online. Those motherfuckers were broken. And they fixed it, and they came back. That's all I'm saying. Instead of play online games where the server is down for two days. Yeah, and they're like, oh, they'll fix it. No problem. We'll enjoy the game after it's fixed. But if they want to hate oh, on the I have to go back. If the people hate on the game, they're not going to ever come back because they don't want to come back. Oh, or look at Assassin's Creed Unity. I don't actually I think it's still glitchy, but after uh, it was so glitchy, they're like, we don't want to go back to that game. It can be fixed. Give it time. Oh, wait. I will go the correct way. Yay. I'm so excited. Now, I don't want to be a person that's all like... Oh! Oh, God! I want to be a person that's all like, well, you should just forgive them because they made a broken game and put it out there. I don't think they should do that either. I think they... Like, remember when we were kids and we got Super Mario World? It was the way it was. And we weren't getting DLC to fix that game. This is a bull boop so I don't think they should really rely on releasing a game and being like, oh, we're going to fix it. Yeah, because back in the day, you didn't have fixing. Yeah, you just had it. It doesn't work out with the glitches. And you didn't have to pay $200 for the other half of the game. No, you just paid for the single game, and that's what you got. And then you had to wait for a sequel a couple of years later or so. I could have swore I rebuilt this. 
But in this day and age, since everything's digital, we all think that DLC will fix our problems. Ha 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 ha! Come get me! Come get it me! Won't. And, then and I agree up. with like I've been watching some stuff on YouTube about it. Open the stupid door! Oh. A lot of people are pretty much just letting it go. They're like, "Well, it'll be fixed either way. Might as well just sit and wait." No, don't buy the game. Go send it back. Tell them that you don't want the broken shit. And that way, it may force them to be like, "Well, oh, no. we better oh, no. release our games complete, or nobody will want to play." Them. I also agree that I would rather have them delay the release of a game instead of getting that broken shit. Yeah, because, oh, geez. you know, you get yourself all worked up over a game, and then when you finally do play it and it's glitchy, you feel like all that time waiting and preparing for it, like going back and playing the other games that were previously before it, you know, you feel like all that time's wasted. Oh, I have ammo. Six ammo. And I don't know about, like, the PlayStation 3. Well, I don't know about the Xbox 360, because I've never had this problem, but the PlayStation 3, I know there were some games, like, as soon as you bought them, there was this crazy long update time. Yeah, and they'd have to wait for it to install. Then it would update. I'm pretty sure that's how it was with Grand Theft Auto 5 with me. Because I bought it and then, and then Payday, it was Payday 2, uh, Sick Cracker Edition, which you guys got me for Christmas. Like, the crazy thing is, you know, first there was that Lizard Squad thing that shut down the system. And then I was finally like, yay, I get to play it, you know. And then it takes this ridiculous <laughs> long time to download. What the heck, man? Like, I've been waiting on this game for, like, by then it was, like, almost two weeks, you know, before I got a chance to play it. The update time was, like, literally, like, four hours. And then what was the one game we saw that was on, uh, the Rage Quit? It was, like, Homefront or something. He had to wait, like, an hour and a half. He's like, that's a really game great game! <laughs> What? And they made the Xbox One and I think PS4 as well, where you have to download your game before you can play your game. That's bullshit. Like, I, d I know it makes it run better and everything, but I don't think you should be forced. No. I think it should be a choice to download it to your system. Which, I, ha I which, myself uh, had to PS4, buy a new hard drive. PS4, you can actually download it while you're playing. You can it's like live stream. somewhat on this. It depends on the game. Like, it's like, Oh, this game's ready to play, and then all you can access is the fucking menu. You're like, up yours. Like, I love you, Xbox! Call of Duty <laughs> actually allowed me to play multiplayer while it was installing, which was pretty cool. Uh, Halo will not. So, what's your games you're looking forward to for now? Deus Ex. Deus Ex looks fun. I want to play the Taken King for Destiny and see if it's any better. I want to play the new Assassin's Creed that's coming out just because I want a derby. Oh god, I gotta run, I gotta run, I gotta run, run away, run away, run away! I'm actually more looking for Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Halo 5, personally. And supposedly it's supposed to be like a mixture of new and old. Which also brings oh, me okay. to another point about like Halo 4. Everyone's like, they didn't change up enough. But do you really expect them to change it up? A, a new company, no. do you expect them to change it up like that? Just think, like, I'll use Fantastic Four, the new movie, as a good example. If you give a, another person the ability to take care of something fans love, and you just try and put your own shit to it, it's going to end up bad. And for the record, always, I've seen it, he hasn't. <laughs> I don't need to, I promise. But when you do that, there's always that big chance that the fans going to be like, why didn't they use anything that we know? Why did they change it? In some cases, you know, they have the rights to it. Which so, that doesn't happen in video games, but... I bet like, say they just went with the Prometheans. It sounds cool, and it worked out well. But say they just did that, no one knew what to expect, so it could have just been a hit or miss. So they brought back the old enemies to have some familiar... <laughs> Say it for me, because I'm going to have trouble. Familiarities. Thank you. I said it while yawning. Beast mode and engaged. 
I have like a stutter. I don't know. Okay. Stutter, I don't know what it is. It's just like be failed to talk. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap like this a, up. It looks like a weird torture device. Uh, hold on. Uh, um, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Maybe leave us a like and subscribe if you liked it. Hit the blue one. And if you have a comment <laughs> of what games you're looking forward to playing or what games. You know, that made you rage quit because the world does leave comments in the comments that you will have to try to hurt you know, my leg or anything or cry out in the comments section below. But you can if you did miss me. That's fine. Did I win? Did I win?